Hello and welcome to JustCompareCars.com. My name is James and today I'm going to be doing a walk around video of this 2019 on a 69 plate Volkswagen Caddy. It's a 2 litre TDI C20 trend line, it's a short wheelbase Euro 6, it's done just 50,000 miles and it's got full service history with three services recorded. Okay, so we've been doing these walk around videos for quite a while now and we find them to be very popular mainly because it means you get to view the vehicle from the safety and comfort of your own home, but as if you were here today with me in person. There's a walk around the van with you today. We'll look at all the panels individually, looking for any marks, scratches or dints. We'll look at the wheels and tyres, looking at the tread depths and under the arch. Obviously, we're going to have a look in the back to see how it's laid out. Then we're going to have a look in the cab, looking at the seats and the functionality. I'll even tell you what it smells like inside. When we've done that, we're going to pop the bonnet and have a look at the engine bay. And finally, if I can get underneath there, uh, we'll have a look at the underside of the engine, the chassis, and of course, if there is one, a spare wheel. Now, once you've watched the video, if you're happy with what you see and you want to buy it, a small deposit will secure it, and we can pretty much deliver it anywhere in the world. If you're looking to finance it, we can go through an application with you, which takes about five minutes and can usually get you a decision within around an hour. Now, it's worth mentioning the vehicle is plus VAT, so the price that you see is plus VAT, so you will need a deposit to cover that VAT, as unfortunately, you are unable to borrow that one for you. Now it's also worth mentioning while you're watching the video, if you think I've missed something or if you'd like to see something in a little bit more detail, please ask, it's not a problem. We work on complete transparency here at Just Compare Cars. So I'd rather show you everything now while you're sat at home and comfortable, so you know that when you come and fetch the vehicle or have it delivered, you know it's not a waste of your time or your money. We've all been there, we've all done it, hence these videos exist. Right. So let's start with the bonnet and then we can work our way around from there. Firstly, also, let me apologise. It's been raining, as you can probably see. Um, so it's a little bit wet. I have waited as much as I possibly can, but I think the heavens are probably going to open up again at some point. So the bonnet's a bit wet, but you just take that into consideration. Believe me, if there's any marks or anything, I'll show you. I can assure you. Right, so the bonnet is actually in great condition no nasty marks or dints. It's really very nice and clean and very tidy. Now it's a UK vehicle. It's been on UK roads for 50,000 miles. There are going to be stone chips. There's not thousands. I've had a good look. That's probably the worst one, if I'm being honest. And again, you go to Volkswagen, get a touch up pen. They'll give you exact touch up. You just dob it and you'll never see it. Um, there wasn't there, there look. I knew I'd seen a couple more. There's a couple there, if you can Appreciate they're like pinhead, and there is one small one there as well, but that's it. There is one there as well, sorry. So, um, driver's side headlight, nice and clean, no damage, misting or cracks. The front bumper is in great condition, as is the grille. And the passenger side headlight the same. Passenger side front wing is in nice clean condition. There's no damage, misting or crack. Oh, there's no damage, choice. sorry. There's no damage, there's no nasty marks or dints. Everything looks in great condition. I promise I'm not going <laughs> to um, Passenger side front wheel and tyre. The wheel's in good condition. Obviously, it's a wheel trim. The trim looks good. There's no damage. Um, tread, 4 mil, maybe a bit more. Under the arch is in great condition as well. Mirror back is colour-coded and in great condition. There's no damage. Windscreen is free from stone chips and cracks. Can't see any at all, really good. So let's have a look at the pillars. There's no dents or damage. Always look at those because obviously, you know, people can put a roof rack on them and obviously then, you know, they're throwing stuff on or whatever, dents can happen, but not on this one. It's in superb condition, really very nice and clean. There is a very fine, it looks like I'm not so it looks like it's rubbed against a bush there. If you can see it, it's not going to show up. I don't think it's fine, but it is there. Right, so let's have a look down the panels. So always a good view to take looking down the panels like this. It's like looking in a mirror. If there was any imperfections, dints or marks, they would just stick out like a sore thumb. And hopefully you'll agree. It's in great condition. I can't see any marks or dints at all. It is really very tidy. Yeah, absolutely spot on. So yeah, nice and tidy. Side door is easy to open one-handed. Nice, decent space to get in there. 
it's got i think that's a plastic bulkhead there's usually about 15 or 16 bolts and you can unplug them and they'll just come straight out if you don't want it in the back it's quite lined um it's actually got a little bit of dust on the floor uh, maybe not i don't know but it's it looks kind of red i don't know what that would be um but the roof's in great condition as is everything else really it's just tidy very clean and tidy or maybe it's plaster maybe it's plaster that's what it could be it might be a plaster as one but yeah really clean and very tidy anyway um so passenger rear wheel and tire wheels in good condition uh wheel trim is also in good condition it's a good year tire loads of tread it looks personally new to be honest with you and under the arch is like new as well uh, passenger side tail light nice and clean no damage misting or cracks saying it right this time rear bumper is in great condition there's no damage we've got parking sensors and there is a protector on the lip which has done its job there's a couple of little marks on it but if you know they just peel off and you put a new one on it so yeah brilliant so barn style doors and they're in good condition there is a little mark there but these pop out i think to be fair and you can replace them if you're bothered don't bother me but we're all different but yeah other than that can't see anything at all so decent size opening at the back applied the metal and everything else looks in great condition as you can see better view now of the rear there is a couple of little marks but you know that's just wood it'll just come out and replace no problem at all use the other bit the old piece as uh, is your uh, guide like a jigsaw puzzle i suppose but yeah life's nice and tidy in there there's no nasty smells it really is very clean and tidy So, driver side tail light is nice and clean, no damage, misting or cracks. Let's have a look at the roof. And as you can see, it's in superb condition. Let's have a look at the pillars on the driver's side. Oh, the camera's playing silly sods, one second. So yeah, they're spot on as well. So we'll look down the panel and again same as the other side i'm just looking down the panel because obviously if there was any imperfections it would just stick out and i can tell you there's nothing it's superb it really is whoever's had this has really looked after it and loved it which is nice to see it makes a change so um driver's side rear wheel and tire wheels in good condition trims in good condition good tire again it looks like new good year tire good quality let's have a look at the door panel and again spot on yeah being picky the black plastic's faded a little bit she wants a little bit of peanut butter oil on it or something or whatever but you can put that back to black on it maybe that'll do it or repaint it or something not damaged it's just it's faded a little bit in the sun onto the driver's side front wing and again it's in great condition there's no damage everything looks spot on and then finally driver's side front wheel and tire the wheel trim and the wheels in good condition the tires a good year and matching to the opposite side about four mil so yeah it's got a full set all around all good tires no issues at all let's just put that down there let's have a look inside so driver's side door card again superb condition there's no damage everything looks spot on all the buttons look nice and clean and tidy all the armrests are really well presented um driver's seat bolsters very firm nice condition there's a little bit of unusual wear on that bit there why i can't tell you but it is there obviously but other than that it's in superb condition spot on let me jump in oh yeah there's no floor mats but the floor's in good condition got the cubby hole down front what you'll use that for i do not know um passenger seat bolsters are very firm material is really nice and clean and tidy 
the roof lining is nice and clean there's a cubby hole up there as well not quite handy for something yeah it all looks nice and clean and tidy dashboards in great condition there's no damage everything looks really clean and very tidy steering wheel is in great condition there's no damage no unusual wear everything looks as you'd want it to um, there is just one key at the moment however it's been used as a part exchange to dealership so like a main dealer maybe the other key will turn up they do sometimes so um head unit obviously you've got is it cd no free cds in this one um we have got dab we've got am fm dab so that's good um, it's got the sd card slots um, what else we got bluetooth for phone media yeah nice bit of kit we've got air conditioning Should give that a go while we're in here AC is on it's on cold Yeah, that works fine. It blows very cold straight away. Um, so dashboard, there's no warning lights on the dashboard. You can clearly see the mileage on there. There's uh, obviously my handbrakes on and I'm not wearing my seatbelt, but other than that, nothing else. Um, what else can I show you? Um, obviously got parking sensors, there's no misfires. Obviously it's showing that because I'm next to that bush, which is fine. Um, can't think of anything else. It, it's, it is what it is. It smells nice inside. Doesn't smell like it's been smoked in. Um, doesn't smell like it's been living on a farm. Everything you did wasn't really. It's a nice clean little van. Really is comfortable for me. I'm six foot two, and there's loads of space. In fact, it's probably at that. That's probably too far for me. But each their own, isn't it? End of the day. But yeah, it's a nice tidy little van. Switch that off. Pop the bonnet while we're here, which is just there, by the way. One pull, let's do it. That's worth mentioning. We do specialise in commercial vehicles, pickup trucks, vans, you name it, we've got it. We've got loads of them, and there's always new ones arriving. But more importantly, they've all got the same style walk around video as this one. So, obviously, you know, if this one's not ticking a box for you, have a look at the website. We've got other vans, more VW transporters, caddies, you name it, we've got it. So, Passenger door card, nice and clean, no damage, everything looks great. Passenger seat, and as you can see, it looks in superb condition. It doesn't look like it's been used, to be honest with you. Um, it's also worth mentioning we are AA affiliated with trading standards approved. So, obviously, you know, you're dealing with decent people, which is a good part. So, the bonnet is on a pneumatic ram. So, there's no messing about with uh, trying to find the bar and hold it up or whatever. Under the bonnet, nice and tidy and clean. Fluids are clean into the correct levels. Quality battery, obviously you had blues there. Things to note, I mean, look, from my point of view, if I was looking to buy this, I'd be looking around the turbo unit, which is just there. There's no signs of any oil weeping or anything like that. There's no signs of any historic oil leaks. Everything just looks as I'd want it to. And the other thing I've noticed as well, it's not been cleaned under the bonnet, so you'll see there's muck there, whatever else. So this is just as it is. It's a nice, clean, genuine engine bay, which is exactly what I'd want to see personally. I don't know about you. Look, like I said before, you know, I'm not a mechanic. If there's anything that you want to see specifically that I'm not showing you at this very point in moment in time, please uh, let us know. Happy to show you anything I can. So shut it down. Hopefully you're still with me. Let's have a quick look underneath. And again, you can see there's no signs of any historic oil leaks. Obviously, you can't see a site under these, to be honest with you, but it all looks clean and tidy. Just have a look if it's got a spare wheel. And... Has it? No, no, it has, has it? No, there's none on this one. Maybe it's not meant to. But anyway, um, hopefully I've shown you everything that you would need to see if you were here today with me in person. Maybe a little bit more. I think I'd rather show you too much than not enough. And I think I've shown most people 
you know, more than maybe what they'd look at if they were here themselves. I have driven it, by the way, it drives great, clutches all right, everything's spot on with it. And you do get a warranty anyway, which is obviously that peace of mind that you need. But anyway, for the moment, thanks for watching, thanks for sticking with me, I really appreciate it. Take care, stay safe, bye-bye.